All right, ladies. All right, what the hell? <laughs> What's wrong with me? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic. Now we're just gonna go back to Tatooine and do the whole bonus series, as well as ex explore the planet, because if nothing else, it gives us some good experience. Now, uh, this thing is now at 450, which means that it can be used for many good things. I'm kinda lost. I totally forgot what that was on. Oh, right, 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 right. I can get the uh, new grade, grade uh, 8, I believe. Yes, grade 8. Uh, w which I will keep on building. To easy, to expand my knowledge of Cybertech more easily. And many more blueprints. It will be quite legend. Wait for it. Dairy. So, to that end, I'm just gonna have Quinn and the droid 2v... 2vr8 constantly on these missions. Vanadium flux for you. Uh, what is this? Scavenged, scavenged metals for you. And let's go. We have three more heroics to do, that should give us uh, around just over 60,000, or is it 50, I don't know. All I know is that there's a bonus series over there, it's Sergeant Shanso. You my friend. Take a look at the stock, what can I get you? Honestly, nothing. Appreciate your business. This is gonna come in very useful way later. So let's just speak with Sergeant Shansa. Target sighted, sweep the area and escort the package. What's the situation here? If you'll remain where you are, my lord. Make way for Moff Yorian. So much fuss over a walk to the spaceport, you'd think I'd break my own neck without a bodyguard. I'm Marah Yurian, overseer of this sector. I trust your visit has been both enjoyable and productive. I won't be coming back for pleasure, or at all, if I can help it. I'm sorry to hear that, especially when I'm so grateful for your help civilizing this planet. Tatooine may not be prestigious, but it is useful. We've hosted everything from archaeological digs to weapons testing facilities. A clean slate means opportunity. Imagine Imperial Tatooine as a bulwark against the Republic and underworld corruption throughout the Outer Rim. Crime syndicates run half this planet already. You mean to turn that around? Eliminate the disease, and the symptoms will fade. Intentionally or not, you've already struck blows to the Exchange, the Sand People tribes, and others. You have unfinished business, and before you leave, I'm offering you a part in this sector's subjugation. When the Minister of War honors your accomplishments, you'll have me to thank. Understood? The Empire will have you to thank, but I'll show my gratitude. Shall we begin? Without an Imperial Legion, we need unconventional allies to secure territory, and the local Mandalorian mercenaries are legendary. I've opened relations and posted officers in their settlement, but the Mandalorians must also learn to respect us. You can arrange that. You don't even have the strength to secure this planet yourself. Because troops are in limited supply, would you rather do nothing? The Mandalorians use the wastelands outside their village as a training ground. If you survive the passage, they'll be forced to acknowledge you. But retrieve the corpses of their initiates who died in the wastes, wastes drop dro their own dead at their feet, and they'll be forced to see you as a challenge. If we humiliate the Mandalorians, they'll only turn on us. Not if we humiliate them by their customs. Put them in their place and help my men, and our conquest can begin. Sir, Colonel Gorick is waiting to report. If you'll excuse me, but think on what I've said. Work with me, and the rewards will be magnificent. That ass shake when he left, though. So hot.
we are gonna go to this place over here, the marketplace, and uh, upgrade our cybertech. And I just crashed into the wall. Here we are, not close enough. How to use up a lot of money quickly, guide by Mr. Sergo15. Do you think there's a grenade up to V10? I don't know. We shall see. All I know is that I used up a lot of money. Like, a lot of money. So where do you want me to go? Over there, copy that. Outpost Varoth. Recover Mandalorian remains. Over there. Alright, let's go. Hey, Cap. We've still got most of the map to explore, this may take a while. But then again, it may not. Only time will tell. So, Mandalorian remains. Got any of those? Ah, there we go. Mandalorian remains by Sand People Scout. A Sand People Scout killed a Mandalorian. Somehow, I doubt that. Well, I suppose that not all Mandalorians are of the caliber of Candorous Order and the like, but still. Hello, I would like to you to I would like to talk about our Lord and Savior Skywalker. One more. There he is. He has four guardians though. Oh dear. What will I do now? I know, lightsaber them. Oh, there's two corpses here, actually. Nice. There's an outpost there? Yep, there's an outpost there. Let's go! Hello there. Mandalorian, I've been through your training grounds. I survived what your initiates couldn't. What are these? 
You brought the dead here? Not just any dead. Our dead. You think you can walk into our village and insult us, Imperial Dog? No. He speaks the truth. Our initiates failed, where this man did not. Welcome to our village. You have earned the right to be here. More than those stooges Mafiorian pays us to protect. What is your clan's relationship to the Moff? We agreed to provide space and security for some of his men. He's asked for more, but we will not become Imperial servants. They're afraid of you already. I'm Ensign Ver. The Moff asked me to congratulate you and pass on a message. He's transferring credits to your accounts as a gesture of goodwill. A taste of what's to come for all his valued allies. Tell the Moff I don't work for him and I won't be bribed. Ah, uh, yes. I'll certainly let him know. He also emphasized that he's counting on you to force the Mandalorian's respect and to eliminate any threats to our security. Good luck. Well, this should be fun. Hi. Of course, Commander. Our relations with your people are based on respect, not just credits. Your concerns will be addressed. See that they are, Retour Jamie. My lord, Zola Alvarnus, diplomatic service on assignment to the Mandalorian settlement. I'd like a moment, if you please. Is that your natural face? It's ugly as hell. I'm always willing to listen to a beautiful woman. <laughs> That's very flattering. A pity we have to discuss business. The Mandalorians let us use their village as a staging area. But they're starting to resent our presence. It's time we moved on. Not far from here, there's a bunker in the hands of Gamorian raiders. Brutish, deadly creatures responsible for the massacre at the Vactuine mining colony. But if we had that bunker, we wouldn't need to share resources with the Mandalorians at all. This means nothing to me. Establishing a forward outpost is key to our Tatooine operations. The Gamorians will mount a stern defense, but if you can soften the opposition and bring me their base's computer codes, it'll be enough. The Imperial Garrison can complete the takeover, leaving the Mandalorians to do what they will. To V, you've done well. I will perform according to your exacting specifications, Master. Hi. Garrus Palin, inventor, artist, and general mischief maker at your service. You look like a man of taste. Perhaps you're interested in my sonic earwax removal system. Oh, or this shiny globe. It will stay with you wherever you go. I've been looking all over Tatooine for an earwax remover and a shiny globe salesman. They're yours. You're the first person to show any interest in this junk. Look, just between you and me, I'm not really a junk salesman. It's just a cover. I'm from Imperial Intelligence's Experimental Weapons Division. Supposed to trick hapless fools into testing a new weapon. But you're neither hapless nor a fool. Sounds like a bad idea to me. But I haven't even told you what it does. It's a marvel. You won't regret it. This is the Sand People deployment device, designed to send a signal that stirs up Sand People against the enemies of the Empire. I need someone to plant this device over at these farmland coordinates. It's the perfect test site, abandoned but covered in wildlife for the sand people to attack. I'll look into it when I can. The device should have a range of two kilometers. There are sand people settlements all over this area, so it should be plenty. That's what I'm trying to find out. All right, so we have something more. A mission terminal. Governor's bounty board. Vacation's over.
Hi there. Take a breath. Your news can wait that long. But sir, Warus Ordo is dead. We... I... We followed him and saw... It was because of the poison. The sand people got him. Then he is not the best. This trial is for the best of men. That is what Warusman Ordo came to Tatooine to prove. Do not mourn for him. The only true death is to fear to try. Like the Imperial puppets who let politics dictate their lives. Now you've got my undivided attention. I've heard of you, Sith Lord. The Empire says you're someone to be feared. Not that I give a Bantha's backside what the Empire thinks. They've backed out of a perfectly good war to hide behind a piece of paper. If you want to change my mind, you're welcome to try. You will learn why no one speaks this way to a Sith. Prove yourself with your flesh, not by twisting my mind. And you'll have my respect to the end of my days. The trial is this. The Sand People distill a lethal poison, and only their holiest of shrines have the antidote. Guarded, of course. To prove yourself, you will take the poison voluntarily, and then fight your way to the antidote before you succumb. It was this which killed Warrisman Ordo, and many others who were called hero on different worlds. Will you take the poison? I've survived worse. Hmm. More guts than I'd have wagered. Here it is, then. You've got the time it takes the poison to travel from your arm to your brain. By then, you'd better have the antidote in hand. Sand people are all over the place. Finding their shrines will not be the hard part. Surviving long enough to reach them will. You obviously don't know that I, uh, kill every sand person I see. I have 15 minutes to do that. That's more than enough time. So, where to? Whoa, it's way over there. Okay. I can do all of them. I'm pretty sure that I'll be able to do them without any issue. So here's this, Outpost Renar. Or is it Renar? Or is it I don't care? I'll do that on my way back, actually. Womp Red Skulls and the Portable Prototype. So let's find some Womp Reds, shall we? That was easy. That was extremely easy. Way too easy if you ask me. Okay, now let's activate the portable prototype. Wonder what it shall do. I wonder how many of them there are. Probably not enough to do anything to me, really. I'm gonna head there last. For now, let's just get uh, the antidote from the sand people. Pretty sure there's also a uh, bonus here. I think it's a uh, staged bonus as well. So let's keep an eye out for that. The Eastern Wound. He whispers death. Yep, it's a stage bonus, alright. 
This should be fun. You asshole. I was in the middle of killing you. Did I attack the Manta by accident? Yeah, it seems like it. Four more. This is actually quite easy, I have to say so. Just one more. And that's it. That's stage one. What is stage two? Destroy sand people totems. War totems. Got it. Is that a war totem? Yes, it is. I need to destroy only six. One. That's not a war totem. That kind of looks like a war totem. But not really. What's the difference between a regular totem and a war totem? Can you tell me? Looking for war totems will pay credits. Aha, uh -huh, here's number two. Combat roll. Hey guys. Hello there. Number three. Anything else of use? Ooh, pants. Very good pants, mind you, but they are shield. I lose so much power, it's not worth it. Okay, so three more. There's one. Ah, so these are war totems. So why is that not a war totem? I was... he was mine. Just one war totem left. Wait, I didn't loot that guy? Well, I'll do that right now.
Now, let, we'll not go down there just yet, because I believe that that's where the final boss is, not the, this boss. Right? Correct. Whoa, look at the light. This is pretty cool. Even if completely moronic, it's still cool. Hey guys, do you have a war totem or something up here? Yes, you do. And the cure. Now, I'll look to impress by... Defeating this guy with the poison in my body. Okay, now, after this, let's just... Turn on all of our defensive moves and go on the offensive. Done. Success, my lord. Nice job, Quinn. So, how many can you make? One. You need way more grade 8 scavenged compounds. Get, get us more scavenged metals. Well, yeah, I kind of think you're useless. Yikes. Damn it. I'll take care of these guys if she take care, takes care of that guy. I think it's a fair exchange. Let's go. Now we're gonna do... Uh, Heroic 2 plus blood and sand and a shot at blood gouge. I will gouge his blood Administer the antidote and not a moment too soon